There has been what seems like a dramatic escalation in the war of words between the United States and Iran. President Trump today gave the Navy shoot to kill orders against any Iranian boats that harass them. 13 News Now military reporter Mike Gooding has reaction. Tensions are rising in the Persian Gulf following a series of provocative actions by the Iranian Navy and a new tweet today from President Trump. Iranian naval vessels repeatedly conducted dangerous and harassing approaches towards U.S. Navy warships in the North Arabian Sea in recent days. That apparently provoked President Trump to tweet this morning, I have instructed the United States Navy to shoot down and destroy any and all Iranian gunboats if they harass our ships at sea. Now we as the military have to apply that clear direction from the commander in chief into lawful orders that we execute. And we know what that means. We have no, no doubt what that means. Now, if you come across and you're in a safe distance and you're waving, that's one thing. If you have a gun and you point it at me, that's another thing. Former Navy Captain Joe Bouchard was commanding officer of a guided missile destroyer. My initial reaction to Trump's tweet is uh, it reinforces what the rules of engagement already allow. Uh, it does not uh, eliminate the judgment call that a commander has to make to determine whether or not he's threatened. But Second District Representative Elaine Luria said the president's continued issuing of orders to our military via tweet is a threat to our national security, and if followed without clear guidance and rules of engagement, will unnecessarily escalate tensions with Iran and possibly lead to all-out conflict. Mike Gooding, 13 News Now.